All right, so YouTube is now done processing. You can easily tell because you can see the thumbnail of the video, and um, we can now proceed. So now we have two options. As you know from a previous lesson, you can um, now upload this to Facebook, uh, use the code, and embed it to your video, or maybe you want to edit it and use the annotation feature. This is what I'm going to do, um, and what I typically do. First, I click on the uh, play button, and now that takes me to the main screen, and um, the reason that I do that is because right here, at the bottom of the video gives me some options. So right off the bat, I'm just going to, I want to load this video and get this out on um, her Facebook account. So we're gonna, just going to click on Facebook. Okay, so we have successful login to Facebook. This is the screen that you receive when you're uploading a video from YouTube to Facebook. And... I click post, and now it's going to automatically post to her profile. Now, the next thing that we're going to do um, is, and this is off the screen, but what I'm doing is I am copying the URL of this video from YouTube. And the reason that I'm doing that is that I'm now going to take that code and go to one of my favorite sites for video annotation, bubbleply.com. So I logged into my account. I paste the URL of the video from YouTube. I click uh, Next. And now, in real time, you're seeing how the screen looks for adding annotations using Bubbleply. So we've already gone through that in an earlier video. So I'm going to take a minute or two, add some annotations, show you what I've done, and then we'll go to the next step. So I've now added a couple annotations that I want to use. I've left one up here on the screen for you to see because I want to mention to you when you're adding annotations with a live link, you need to think through whether or not you want the viewer to click on that link, particularly if you use the live link button and um, leave that video. So when you're using live links and they follow your direction, they're going to leave this video and go somewhere else. In this particular case, that's okay with us because when they go to this particular link, it's actually at the same um, website. So be careful of that. And now, the, uh, uh, now that the annotations are done, I'm going to, again, we're in bubbleply.com. So I'm going to click Done. And... What Bubbleply does, as you may recall, gives, uh, gives us the embedded video and bubbles for the site. And this is really the next step that we want to learn, and that is how to take this code and add it to our website. So I'm going to copy all of this code. So I should uh, select all, click copy. And then um, this is the website, liferights.com. And for purposes of this training, what I'm going to show you is that we're going to add this video right on the home page, right in this section here. Now, this particular website has been done with the program Excite Pro. Um, and the goal of this training is not to teach you all about Excite Pro. I will, re I will tell you 
that um, this is the design page of the home page. Um, and what's important for you, whether you're using, um, whether you're using uh, Dreamweaver or uh, one of the other HTML editors, it doesn't matter. Uh, certain logic remains about the same with all of these editing uh, programs. And that is right now I'm, I'm in the text editing section of the home page. Okay, and you may recall that I want to put this video um, right about in this section. So I'm going to center that. Well, I don't want to center the text. I want to center the cursor. So let's move that down just a little bit. I'm going to center it. Okay, now it's going to be off your screen, but what I'm going to do, well, before I do that, so I can find this section, I'm just going to type a word so I can find it in the code. Okay, so I'm now going to go to the source code page in my HTML editor, which in this case I'm using an Xside Pro template. And um, I'm going to look for that code, uh, or that word rather, which is here. Now I know about where to look, so um, well, here is here. So let's just, uh, we don't want that word in there, I want the code. So there's my cursor, I'm going to now paste the code that came from Bubbleply. I'm going to, it's off your screen, but double check the design and for and for, for Bubbleply you're going to see or at least what I see is something that looks like this is called object. And from past experience, I know that that is probably what I should be expecting to see. So what I'm going to do is um, now save this. So I've moved this screen just a little bit so you can see some of these buttons at the top. The design, again, is the text editing section. The source is the source code. Um, it may those those buttons may look will probably look different if you're using another um, <clears throat> program like Front Page, Dreamweaver, um, or even many of the free HTML editing programs out there that are wonderful. So uh, now that I'm finished with this and I've saved it, I'm going to I'm going to go all the way up here and click publish and uh, it's asking me if I want to publish and yes and I'm going to pause this while it takes you through this process one thing I always try to avoid is having you spend your time waiting for processes on the computer uh, that kind of drives me crazy when I'm watching training videos and I'm going to try not to do that to you I'm back on liferights.com I'm going to um, refresh this page and hopefully if everything went well the video is going to be there and if it doesn't you're going to see it at the same time as uh, as me so let's just see what's going on with this well there we go how about that <laughs> that's just magic isn't it okay so I'm gonna start playing this um, for you The annotations work, the video works, and um, you've just witnessed the uh, magic of taking a video from flip camera, flip video, to the hard drive, up to YouTube, to Facebook, and now on to the website. So I hope you enjoyed that, and I look forward to your comments and questions, and stick around. Don't miss the next you. YouTube Mastery Training Session. I am Steve Pollitt. Thank you very much for your attention and interest, sending you the energy of wellness, happiness, and joy. See you in the next training.